fun. Okay, y'all, wait for it. Hey y'all, it is Haley. I just got back from my girl's day shopping at all my favorite stores with my girlfriends and eating sushi. We had so much fun. <laughs> Let me fix my camera. I feel like I'm a little bit high and there's like a fly flying around as well and my hair is crazy from trying on clothes. But I want to show you what I got. I got it all in one bag. Can you even believe it? They were like, Haley, you, you got to get all your stuff out of the car. I'm like, I just have the one bag. It's lots of bags inside of the bag, but pretty good for me because usually I have way more than one so um let's see where did we go um this is tj maxx um merit the last time we were at the pool lost his goggles and freaked out so i bought him some at the pool and he hates them so i saw these he had speedo ones are the ones he lost he loves so much but these seems like they look a lot like the Speedo ones, and I think Hurley is the good brand, and he's obsessed with anything hot pink. So I picked those up for him, and then I got to the checkout, and I was like, Mary was kind of still behind, and then I thought, I can't get Merit some, and not, is my hair sticking up? And not get Koi any? <laughs> Craig will be proud. I'm still messing with my hair, even during a haul. Um, so I said, grab those turquoise ones. Um, so she grabbed them and threw them across the aisle to me so that I could get Koi some too. Um... I kind of got these on a whim, thinking to Halloween. Yes, I did. They are Treasure X Monster Goggles. Oh, those, those goggles were $5.99. These were $3.99. Um, they love these Treasure X things, and we haven't gotten them in a while. And this, I don't know if you can see that. Let's see if it'll focus. It is a little, like, jack-o'-lantern monster thing. So, you know we do the Halloween countdown that hangs on the wall with all the little pockets. So, I thought, ooh, I don't know if these will fit in there. But, it'll be a fun, like, little Halloween treat. So, I'll save those. Um, one of our girlfriends had a little baby girl last week. And I had not had time to get her anything. So, I saw this. Let's see. Is this the right way? This cute little bubble. How cute is that pattern? I thought it looked almost a little bit Western with the eyelet. Kind of, she's a little farm girl. So I thought that was cute. So we will wrap that up for her. And then um, I had gone to um, Marshall's, I think, and gotten a hula shirt for one of the boys. I'm not really sure on sizing and have really been looking for another one. I'll show you the other one in a minute, but this is the one that I picked up from TJ Maxx. I just thought this was so stinking cute. Uh, is it focusing? I can't tell. Yeah, it's just blue and button up and has little hula girls. I thought it'd be cute with khaki shorts um, for church or whatever, but we are planning to go to, to, on a little kind of beach trip, um, a short little beach trip with my sister while we're in Mississippi, so I thought that these would be fun, and they are just obsessed with anything like kitschy and fun like that, so I'm trying to like capitalize on their love of that now before they get like too cold for school. Um, let's see. Let's do Ross. Um, oh, what is that? Oh, hang on, I gotta take this. Ooh, okay, I'm back. We were at Ross, right? I got another cute little shirt. I'm guessing this one's gonna be Merit size. It's Nomad brand, and it's got like a little desert um, and cactuses. I don't know, I just thought this was so cute. Isn't that precious? Precious, don't tell them I said that. Um, is this a 10? Yeah, 10, 12. So this will be merit size. So I don't know. I think these are cute for church or just whatever. Looking a little bit nice. Um, I did pick this one up for merit. This is just a little Nike shirt. 12. I haven't been telling you prices. That shirt was, do you care? I don't know. That shirt was $7.99. And I think this one, the little hula shirt. This is also nice because we often have like a beach day or a hula day or a tropical day at school. So it's nice to have something kind of to wear for that. $12.99. Um, and that was Cotton Colors was the brand. And I think the other hula shirt I got was that same brand. So I just picked Merit up this kind of hot orange. She loves this color. And just a little Nike shirt. Did I tell you how much this was? I feel like I did. $12.99 for that. Oh, that's kind of pricey. <laughs> Um, I did pick him up this one for $8.99. It's just a little Nike baseball shirt. McCoy has a maroon one like this. It has a little button, but it's still a baseball shirt, and he wears it with a Mississippi State hat, and he thinks he's like a Mississippi State baseball player. So I got Merritt one too. Um, and then I did pick Merritt up this um, blue Under Armour one for $7.99. Now, I don't know. Is this a baseball kind of style, or is this soccer? I have no idea, but he looks so pretty. <laughs> you will kill me if I said that. He looks so handsome in this royal blue color. 
Um, so I got him that. And that's all in a bigger size than what he's wearing now, but he's like almost into that size. So I'm kind of thinking that stuff for like um, going into the school year. Uh, they just had some black socks. These are like those tall over the calf socks, under armor socks. I think this is probably for like uh, soccer, but Koi loves to wear tall socks for everything. So I picked those up for him. Speaking of socks, y'all, I could not resist this. My mama got me a ton of these socks and um, it's the Stance brand, S-T-A-N-C-E, um, in like the little shorty socks and I love them and I saw these, <gasps> y'all, they're like Christmas socks. Oh, you know what? I thought this was a flamingo. Let me turn my light down. But it's probably like a swan, like a seven swans of swimming. I don't know, doesn't that, it's pink. I don't know whatever it is it's stinking cute i just thought they were so fun and i love these socks for um oh i'm real dark uh for like wearing with my boots um so i picked me up some christmas socks for 4.99 i thought those were fun koi socks were 2.99 i think i took the rest of the prices now these pants i did not try on and i will probably regret it but they are like the perfect oyster fall autumn color i think they're a lot like the levi's that i already had but they have a frayed edge and they're not a wide leg but but not skinny jean either um i think they'll be a lot like the ones i have on now i hope anyway they are the i didn't try them on because the line was crazy and there was only one dressing room uh is it called oh jackie high rise straight leg ankle it's called exclamation mark it is the brand and they were 17.99 i can return them if they don't fit but i think that they will and they're nice and stretchy i just love this color i have the levi's in this color and i love them but i feel like you have to um be kind of dressy to wear them because they're the i think they look better with a heel like with my clarks and so i don't wear those all the time blah 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 i got some more cream color pants we'll see if they fit okay Next is going to be Marshall's Home Goods Combo. Here is the other shirt I was telling you about, and it is that same Cotton & Co., and it was $12.99 as well. And it's just got little hula girls. So they're coordinate, but not be matching. I don't know who will wear what or if they'll even be too big for Koi. And I'm kind of annoyed. Elizabeth was helping me look for them, and she found the other one at TJ Maxx after I just bought the one I just showed you. And she was like, oh, that's perfect because you got the size 8 for McCoy, and now this is the size 12, but I had gotten the size 12, so I don't have two size 12s, but if you've seen the vlogs lately, you know that the boys are um, getting real close in size, so it should be fine. Okay, y'all, wait for it. I had to, I had to do it, y'all. It is a bomb pop cutting board, and it is the cutest thing in the world. You know I told you I was gonna do like a candy charcuterie board for 4th of July, and so I thought this would be so cute to do it on. I don't know. I'll use it for something, but I think I will use it for like all the candy and have it laid out cute. It's just the brand Core Kitchen and it's just a large cutting board and it was $4.99. Stop. I love Bomb Pops. I think that's so stinking cute. Um, let's see. What else did I get from there? I got Koi another pair of shorts. He doesn't have this color and y'all know that child loves blue. And these were $7.99. So they're just little blue. Um, they're coming off turquoise, but they're really like a, yeah, like a Carolina Tar Heels. Is that what we call it? Blue. Um, well, that's bright. Um, so I got him those. And then as you know, Mara and b both the boys like to wear these little polo t-shirts. This is going to be too bright again. To do um, horse shows when they run their games. It just looks nice. Um, and they're just nice t-shirts. And they can also wear these to church um, with just like khakis or navy shorts or whatever. I do that every time. you think I'd figure out which way to go. And now I'm so bright. Um, so they had this turquoise and he's got pink and he's got navy. So I thought this would be good. Then he can have three because he had to um, pass all of his down from last year. He had like four or five um, to McCoy. So now McCoy has a ton and Merritt needs to kind of up his game with his little polo shirt. So this was his $12.99 little polo t-shirt um i did get these they're just little it's called anchor and hawking they're just little glass containers with little rubber lids i needed something when i cut up onion i like to cut up a bunch for salads and i like onion and egg and just to have onion on hand for whatever speaking of i really need to um hang on 
I mean, Grand Central Station over here. Anyway, when I put it in a little plastic container, it smells. And I want something that will keep it all contained. And Mary was like, yes, get the glass containers. And then I can use the other ones for whatever. So I've never had the glass containers before, so hopefully they'll be good. And I'm trying, if you've noticed, to kind of keep this red theme within my fridge and all of the organization. So I did get that. Now, y'all, they had a gray dun mug that was like a sage green and it said cowboy coffee and they had multiple of them and i didn't get it i don't know why i just kept thinking when i usually do ray dun it's like themed around like summer or fall or whatever and i was like what am i gonna do with that you know like and it doesn't say cowgirl you know totally regretted it looked forward again at tj maxx because i was gonna get it and they did not have it i'm so bummed but it's fine it was meant to be for me not to take it, but I did get this. It was on clearance. Um, sweet Tea and Sunshine. I thought this one was so cute with the pink um, to use this summer. And I'm sure Meryl will want this one too because he loves sweet tea. <laughs> he likes to drink hot tea out of my mug. So I did get that one. And then I did pick up another MAC lipstick. I love these lipsticks, y'all. They're so good. Um, that's kind of the, it's kind of a corally color. And it's called A Dozen Carnations. And it's just the MAC Cream Sheen Lipstick. Ooh, that is real coral. I like it though. I like it a lot. It's always got a little bit of a sheen to it. I guess that's why it's called that. So I picked that up too. I have several of these that I really like. And then I got one more thing. Um, my niece is coming. Hopefully she doesn't watch this. And she loves a good body scrub. And her birthday is in the July. And so, um, this is an Onyx Bathhouse Foaming Body Scrub, and it's called Birthday Cake, and she loves vanilla, too. And, of course, that's the scent because it's birthday cake. Can we see that? It's just a pretty little cute body scrub. Here I go. Wait for it to get dark, y'all. Um, I don't know. I just thought that would be fun um, for her birthday. And then I'll just, like, stick some money with it and give it to her while she's here because I won't see her on her actual birthday. So, I picked that up for her for $5.99. It's just a little happy. Um, so that's what I got, Marshall's Home Goods. And then we did go by, Mary is a hairstylist. She's the one who dyed my hair. Um, so she can go to like the salon places that you get like a discount. I don't know what it's called. Uh, a salon, you know what I'm talking about. Anyway, <laughs> I love this Amica, 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 I think is what it's called stuff. It's so good. Their dry shampoo is like thebomb.com and their packaging is the cutest thing in the world so i got some more dry shampoo and then i love their hairspray as well so i got the hairspray and then um especially in the summer i love to do a um like leave my hair wet and just do like a beach wave it's so much easier and especially when i go to mississippi and it's so humid i love just to have um wavy hair and not have to dry it and all that and it just looks better so we asked oh my gosh y'all it cut me off my sd card was full i don't know how when i stopped talking but we were asking her what was the best for like a beach wave um type of a situation for your hair and she said this verb brand was good it's called wind sweat waves light texture sea spray it smells so good um and she really recommended it there we go so i picked this up it's almost let me smell it again I don't know how to describe it, but it smells beachy. I guess beachy. I don't know. I like it. I like the way it smells. Anyway, I will keep you posted on if I like it in my hair or not. So, that is what I picked up on our girls day, y'all. Like I said, we shopped and we kind of had like a little light snack kind of at noon. And then we waited till about 3 o'clock to go eat sushi because the sushi place is always crazy busy. Um, so, we did that and we sat outside on the river. Um beautiful day such a good time with my girlfriends we have not been able to get together all of us some of us have met up at the pool with the kids but all of us haven't been able to get together because baseball schedules and horse show schedules and all the things that have just been crazy so it was an amazing day so glad that i could show you what i got make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a thing and we will see you in the next one bye y'all